flying around gathering nests. I'm living proof. I'm pulling off funding for the show. I'm done. Hey, first, first, first. Come on, man. Since he's acknowledged, Garbanzo. Oh, the new policy cleared up, and I'm, I'm glad to be here. Say less, child. I was just giving you... This madness must come to an end. Oh, I, I agree. He is letting his feelings get in the way of our business. Deal with it. Or else we will never get our money back. Your wish is my command, Emperor. Good. Soon we will have her debt repaid. Can I interest you in being? No. Okay. More for me. up for your host, Anthony Pepperchino. <laughs> now you stop it! Oh my god! <laughs> oh wow! What? No guys, please! No, keep going! Ah. I mean, give it up for you guys. Am I right? Thank you all for coming. Thank you. Thank you. You know, I, I got to tell you guys, um, I got some sad news. Really sad news. <gasps> My grief counselor uh, just died. <laughs> I know, sad. Uh, but he was so good at his job, I don't even care. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Where, where, where do poor meatballs live? In the, in the spaghetto. <laughs> I think it might that wide. Oh. Ryan, hold me. Get under my crotch now. Whoa. Hey, hey, hey. I told you I was pulling off funding. You left me no other choice. What? 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 Because the bird joke? These birds. <laughs> I wonder why they're chirping. It's because they got it so easy. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's where I draw the line. You insulted my culture. Your culture. Let's go, Gino. Please. It's time for my all male massage. Please. I can't talk to you right now. Male massage? What? We're taking everything, Gino. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that was disgusting. Oh, homie. Stop. I didn't even need you. I'm done. Well, I'm gonna keep making jokes. In fact, <laughs> you're gonna love this one. Two guys walk into a bar, right? And the third guy ducks. I mean, because, because they walked into it. I got another one. Set. Uh, what, uh, what do you call 
when a couple of monkeys start, start a, a business. business. Ryan, monkey business. <laughs> Come on. Are you gonna take the plants? You Is kidding? They grow in here. Let's go. Come on. They're part of the ground. They're part of the ground? Yeah, they grow from the ground. Holy shit. Linda effing Eldridge. We got all the fucking proof we need. They found their underwear. All the DNA is in their underwear. She got nipple juice, pussy, ass. All right, let me know when you're done shouting and then we can talk. Okay. One thing I wanted to bring up to you. What? I'm kind of on to something. You're with, with this With this case. With I have what? An, I have an idea. Your, your idea is as good as a fart in a windstorm. So my idea is I, I think I'm trying to connect. Why do you have a picture of her? Are you obsessed? Are you in love? So, so hear me out. I'm hearing. I think. Mostly out, but I'm hearing what? Okay. I'm trying to act. All right. <laughs> <laughs> no, I won, anyway, I won an award. I think she's connected with the mob. I think she got into some- The mob? The, mo the mob with the- M-O-B or M-O-P? Well, what makes more sense? So, she's owed some money. To she the, owes them money? She owes them money. And I think that her disappearance is connected to her owing them money. And the reason why she kept doing her show was to pay them off. That's mm. what I'm thinking. Sure, her show wasn't that good. <laughs> She's not gonna pay them off with that show. She has to be hooking. Why is it that I don't know anything about the mob, but you do? But you're sitting here playing with your balls and I'm actually doing the work. I'm at the point in life when my balls play with themselves. How they does clang that... all they want. How does that happen? I don't wear underwear. <laughs> they just clang, man. Based on all this information we gathered, I gathered, because yeah. you just sat there with all right, the take balls all the, Take all the credit again, okay. <laughs> Bonnie. I, I know where they've been filming. So the new hosts have been filming in a plot. I didn't even know they had a new host. Who's the new oh, host? Oh, yeah. This little twerp. He's a little punk. Yeah, a little twerp? He thinks he's better than you. <laughs> His name's Anthony, and he thinks he's a... Uh, he His name is Anthony what? Anthony. And he says, he goes, Dick's Does a he? little... He Wait said, a Dick's a little chump. Oh, that's, yeah. what he said. that's what he told me. Anthony? He says, Dick's a twerp. Well, we'll go see about that. He said he's gonna knock you into tomorrow. Well, let's see it. He said you're a little idiot. Yeah. I've seen some pictures, he's really tough. All he's right. buff. He's buff? He said he'll grab your nuts and twist them and you might like it. I might like it. And Where he is he at? Peg Studio? He called you a little asshole. Yeah, he's at Peg. Look here, when's the next show? Let's call him out during the yeah, show. We're filming right now. Let, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. On you, game, Can boy. we use your car because I drunk, drove mine into a pole? Well, I'm gonna drink drunk mine in. Oh. <laughs> it's hot in here today. Oh. What's going on? Let's get that AC on! Nice place, what they done with this, huh? The pandemic money must have been nice. <laughs> Who's that guy? I don't know. Ooh. Hey guys, I'm looking for Anthony Peppercino and Ryan. Uh... Yeah, yeah, just Ryan, that's my name. Look at you, huh? Nice, right? Yeah, top of the fucking line. Yeah, he got it from the store. Really? That pandemic surplus, huh? That's, that's I got like five social security numbers wow. from that fucking thing, yeah. <laughs> fucking crazy. <laughs> uh, uh. You know this guy? I'm Uncle Pill Bottle. You may know me from the tune. You know the tune? Yo, pediatrician with the triangle shape. Pee pee. Oh, oh my god, I know that guy. What the frick did he ask? Oh my god, what are you doing here? I regret to inform you that you guys are actually conjoined twins. Oh my god. Yes, from birth. Years ago, you guys were separated wrongfully. Need we you to come back oh my god. to save your lives. We're against time. Oh, whatever it takes. Anything, Dr. Fulbano. Don't. Is Linda still here? Uh, you know, like, Not today. I, I thought that she was. But like, I, I came in the front. I think she might have went out the back, but I, I got a spin class, but we got to do this quick. 20 minutes in my place. We got to do this fight because if we don't do it, then what happens? You guys die. Oh. I don't want you guys to die, <laughs> right? Yeah, no, I hate, I hate to die. 20 minutes, spin class, then see me. Save your lives. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, uncle. Doctor! I mean, uncle. Doctor! His peepee's a triangle. <laughs> Nothing like a can of dulce and garbanzos beans. Nothing like it. You gotta shut this off before everybody hears us. Yeah, just be quiet. You're like you're loud enough already. You don't want to like. Uh, well, just 
just the loudest guy in the world, some people have said. They can hear me from Africa. <laughs> what is specific? Are we gonna get Linda Rod out of this or somebody saying something? Know, what I are we gonna do? It, I, if, I think if she, she wouldn't be there because they're not filming with her. It's that little twerp that wants to punch you in the mouth. Oh, that kid did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, no, well, he I said, like to get a hold of him. <laughs> Why don't we take some pictures of the studio? Just case it out. Let me, let me get the cameras out. Come on, yeah. be professional, man. Oh, yeah. Hold on. The tax collect. I think the IRS is calling me. The IRS, yep. They're coming. 87,000 agents they hired. Wait, they're, wait, they're, oh, I got them. I got them. Oh, that's dope. That's one of the. Um, I'm just gonna that's one of the sponsors. Sponsor for what? Don't keep, Depends keep, for keep, who? All the, yeah, Depends for Linda? Yeah. But why is he taking? He's taking all the stuff, all the props. Like, that's the sign from the Linda show. Why is he taking it, is. it out? What the fuck is he doing? I don't know. He's probably giving it to the IRS. Look at There's an IRS like they... agent behind us. <laughs> hey, 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 don't touch that. We're gonna get we're gonna get arrested, man. What the fuck? Do you want some beans? No, not working in the car with you. <laughs> fuck that. Take a couple more. I'm taking them. Okay. All right, let's, we should probably get out of here. All right, let's go. I'm out of here. Let's Grab this. Want to bring these back to the chief? Who? You don't even have the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> well, nobody will notice. You had the lens, you had the lens cap. Well, no, they're gonna why, see why the, the one I couldn't see through it. But are you gonna put a maybe put something on it? No, maybe you take it off before you take the pictures. Welcome to the Big Kid Show. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my god. Hey, welcome back to the Big Kid Show. <laughs> we got Ryan. Oh. Hey, you guys. Up next is a very special guest. You know, you might know him uh, from the Brian Show, and that one time he shoved the pencil so far up his ass, he tasted it. Let's go for Brian Allen Fortune. Hello. <laughs> the fucking ice machine from McDonald's on Amistad Boulevard is broken. Son of a bitch. Hello, oh, folks. Papa. How you doing? Hey, so Brian, I got some questions for you today. Are you up for the task? Sure, why not? <laughs> I don't know. The mic, the mic fell off. Something horrible is happening inside of me, and I don't know why. Holy moly, I'm so. Ryan, stop bitching. Don't be a bitch. <laughs> how, how long you been doing your show for? And uh, how did it feel when the pencil uh, 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 was was shoved up your ass? <laughs> Fourteen years. I Whoa. Guess. Yes. I was Woo! In the pencil? Well, that was an accident. <laughs> That's what they all say, Brian. Come on. Oh my gosh. I was drunk. Hey. I was drunk. Aren't we all? <laughs> what What exactly was your inspiration for, for, for the show's name? I mean, it, it, it is unique. Yes. Well, me, me and my former uh, cousin, like, we were just fucking around with a cam. I mean, I mean meth around with a, with a camcorder. It was like, we we're doing terrorists. Oh, oh. The, the amount of characters that you have, what what would you say was your least and, 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 and most favorite characters to, to, to play? Uh, well, this new one is like Ball Sack Jack. Yep. He's like a deranged lunatic. <laughs> wow. I'm kind of fighting with him now on my show. Mm. You can't make a good video to save his life. He's a piece of shit. What the fuck are you saying to me? Jack Ball sack? Did you call me a piece of shit? Like I actually hit I actually hit the imaginary character. Whoa! Ooh. I think that's assault. You could get arrested for that. <laughs> oh. Oh. Gotta hate some gotta hate somebody. I hate us right now. Yeah. <laughs> Papa John's or Little Caesars? Uh, Little Caesars. Mmm. Pizza pizza. Pizza pizza. Hey, uh, Hey, so colored pencils. This is good old action, uh, 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 D Dixon. <laughs> number, yellow number two. Hey. It feels better. I was gonna say, 
You know why? Much it's better. That, it's that what glossy size? finish. Which side do you put in the eraser? First? Yeah, I put the eraser in. You know, I, I gotta say, Brian, I, when I'm going in, normally it is that that sharp side, and, and I know what you're thinking. Whoa, no, but it, it's that tapered edge that you want in first. You know, you want to ease your way in. The eraser, it's just gonna it's just gonna leave rubber burns all the way in. You know, I mean, I know Ryan knows. I mean, we we, we share a, 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 a what they call a um, cloaca. It's a it's a unihole. You know, Brian, uh, I, I gotta ask you, what, what is the one thing you regret having done the most? What have I regret done the most? Oh, the pencil thing. I was, just, I was gonna say it, but you beat me to the punch. <laughs> yep, that's what I regret. Because people keep bringing it up over and over again. Yeah, they do, don't they? Yep. I hate those people. The people who were doing that to you, Brian, same people who have a special place in uh, hell. If you know what I mean. Yeah. See, you know where I'm going yeah. with this. Yeah. In fact, I know you know what I'm thinking. Isn't Ryan just the cutest? He is adorable. <laughs> you know, Brian, I, I, I really have just loved having you here today. In fact, you know, if, if I have one takeaway from this, I'd say stick it to the number two and the number two, if you know what I mean. No, let's just not, just not, just not talk about that shit right now. <laughs> yeah, I know, am I right? <laughs> That's our clapping. I did other stuff for, for 14 years except for that. I yeah. did a lot of other things. You know, Anything but but here's the part? thing, you know, you, you do that one thing and that's all you're known for. Just like Pee Wee Herman, you know? I, I want to be known for more than just a pencil thing. What exactly uh, can we see from, from the Rancho in 2022? Can you, can you give us a taste? Might even review some movies in 2022. Uh, maybe some pencil reviews, I'm going to be honest with you. <sighs> Wow, and they, thank you so much for, for coming coming to the coming to the show today. <laughs> hey you guys, up next, we got the Rhode Island Bucket Drummers. If you thought this guy was a hoot and a holler, you're gonna say, where's the pencil in his ass? Oh, Jesus. Ow! And now, a word from Gregory Tull Sanchez. Circumcising baby boys should be a crime. Circumcising baby boys should be a crime Who gives the parents a right to destroy a man's spin penis? Circumcision is, should be a crime But I get it, they want, they want me angry They want me to do that bit They want me to get angry Yeah For comedy Angry. How you feeling, man? No, for real. I, I'm in pain. I'm in a lot of pain. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. <laughs> you know, we got two special guests right now. You know them. We got Derek and James from the Rhode Island Bucket Drummers. I appreciate you. I gotta go. I'm doing this uh, stand-up bit on a sketch comedy show. Thank you. I'll talk to you later. Appreciate it. Boom. Hello. Hi. Uh, Michael. Uh, nice to meet you. Stand-up comedy? Yeah. Mike, I'm so sorry. I gotta bump you tonight. <laughs> Come I, got on. The, I got the Rhode Island Bucket Drummers right now. Who? The Rhode Island Bucket Drummers, they were on the road show. I mean, I completely cleared my schedule. Completely. I and I feel terrible, but... Oh! <laughs> All right, come on, come on, let's go, come on. Now? We got a minute, come on. Now? Yeah. I gotta go? Go. Give me a thing, man. Man. Hey! That's a wrap. How's it going? Good. Nice. Uh, I do uh, do comedy. Wow. You guys. Uh, 
Hey, got a rim shot. I like that. Thank you. Excited to be here. And uh, how are you guys doing? Um, I'm excited to be here. This is a... Uh Excited to be here, I think. This is definitely not resume building. <laughs> it's like the Tonight Show without all the fun. Uh, I, uh, I'm a doggy daddy. I am the proud daddy of a English Labrador named Big Murph. When I came here to do the really big show tonight, Big Murph was in his Murphopedic watching the animal planet. And he said, go get him, daddy. I'll be right here when you come back. Okay, you don't see him. Uh, we're in the middle of uh, uh, rescuing another dog. We don't know Good which guy. way to go. The English Wolfhound, the German Shepherd. But I think we're going to go with the Spanish Landscaper. Guys, and it, we, we gotta just get the 20 minutes back. This is embarrassing. You guys suck at conjoined twins. You guys suck. Oh, they fucking suck. We're better than Mary Kate naturally. They're not conjoined. We got Ryan. Excellent, my child. Excellent. 